Sean Strickland, the new middleweight champion of the world, talks about Logan Paul, Dylan Dennis, Jake Paul, all the drama going on between Logan Paul's fiance and Logan Paul himself, including his brother Jake Paul and Dylan Dennis. Sean Strickland was on the Note Boys podcast where he talked about this situation and how he would handle about it. Sean Strickland was not happy with Dylan Dennis and uh, all the stuff that he brings for promoting the Logan Paul fight and uh, he was not pretty much happy after seeing all this stuff so these guys so I watched you in the Dylan Dennis and you were more like the reasonable one. like you were being a little beta you wanted to like you wanted to tell him what's up you wanted to say hey dude talking about that guy's life you're a piece of it and you're you you were a little bit more <laughs> like folded yeah, you a little bit more. You folded a little bit more. Yeah, like I did. you were a little bit more like I'm gonna I'm gonna sky off and be part of the club. Yeah, yeah. but that's not part of the club because most people feel how you do about him. And no, but I'm saying, but what I'm telling you though, it's like, it's harder to be this guy to say, hey, Shit. like it's harder to be this guy to say, hey, what you're doing is not right. You know, there, and I still think it should be that way. So what you do, bro, you have this kind of this old school mindset that like you know make fun of me, whatever you want, but there's lines not to cross. And that's a harder that's a harder position to take than to kind of be a little bit more Weasley. But you need a balance of it, Steiny. Oh, it's kind of Weasley Steinly, you know. That's, <laughs> that kind of goes a little bit, bro. So guy. let me tell you, when it comes to the Jake Paul brothers, I, I stay away from it. And but you're on Twitter a lot, so you got. I'm see on it. Twitter a lot, and I rant a lot more than I should, dude. But it's like, and I I say this because I'm part of the problem. As opposed to like a real man, and again, I'm going to say watching your podcast, you, you weren't fourth, but a real man would say, hey, first of all, man, no, that shit's not cool. I'm not going to support you. I'm not going to watch your, like, I, I guess he leaked names. I don't think he leaked them. I think they're already on but the did internet. You, but you look, did you look at them? I did. But, but again, me, like, that's kind of like part of the problem. Like, whenever you see something like that, the beta male weak aspect thing to do is to say, no, I'm going to go look at this woman's, but like a real man would say, you know what? You're not going to look at her wife. I'm not, even though, even though I want to Google the photo, but I'm not going to do it because the moment I Google that photo and I go look at it, I'm part of the problem. Sean Strickland was going at Dylan Dennis and Note Boys himself doing a podcast with Dylan Dennis. I mean, at this point, this is a thing that uh, I might agree with it because this is not a way you promote the fight or something like that. But when Dylan Dennis started doing all this stuff, he became a lot more famous he gained million of followers day by day he was getting over 100 million of views and uh, everybody the famous personalities were talking about him but sean strickland did not like the idea of dylan dennis so 